Hi everyone, it's Nicole Lynn from Facilitating Love on Earth. We are going to journey with the guardian rocks of the earth. And so if you want to listen to this and then go outside and connect with the boulders and the rocks where you live, um, that would be wonderful. So you could be um, technology free. If you want to bring this recording outside with you that's totally fine and if you want to just even do it in your own house um, I am on the back hill where I live and I am sitting among these giant boulders and uh, connecting deeply with it and I wanted just to share what's coming through so as you Find yourself among the guardian stones and boulders and rocks of your land, of the earth, the record keepers, the ancient ones who record the history of time. Go and sit or lie down and touch and open your feeling senses to fully become one with these boulders or rocks or stones. And as your body synchronizes to these stones, you can actually feel movement. The earth and these stones are moving and pulsating and vibrating. Like the blood flows in your body, like the tingles and ripples of energy, so too is that energy moving within these boulders. Take a few mo moments just to connect with those vibrations. The more you can let go and connect with your own subtle vibrations, the own, your own pulsing blood and heart, the more you're gonna be able to feel theirs. These ancient guardian stones are watchers and seers and they take in everything that is going on far and wide not even just exactly the location in which they're placed they have a huge radius like our auric field they too have this huge radius auric field that can draw in and sense and perceive their surroundings and environment far, farther than we could even imagine. And they communicate with one another across this time and space. And when you think a lot of times of recording data or information, a lot of times we think of judgment as if these stones that know everything that has ever happened here on the earth would hold judgment or blame or shame. And yet they are completely neutral and free of all of that. They just simply record. And maybe we will never know why, why they are recording. Just like us with our digital age and technology, we're always recording things. I'm recording this for you right now. And maybe we don't know why. Why do we do anything that we do? We just do. 
Maybe it's just in their nature. Maybe they just can't not. But as your vibration and their vibration are merging and synchronizing and becoming one, you can feel their life force energy and you know that they too are alive. They are living sentient beings purposefully placed here on this earth, purposely formed from the earth, no different than you and I. And how often do we walk and we unrecognize them? We don't even notice them as if they're invisible. So in this journey, we are sitting and lying down and we are merging with them and we are saying, I see you and I feel you and I recognize you and I thank you. Thank you for your protection. Thank you for watching over us and recording. Thank you for not judging. Thank you for being silent, but powerful. Thank you for being strong, but not forceful. And thank you for allowing me and us to connect with you. These beautiful, beautiful stones. I want to pick the phone up and show you how giant they are, these ones that I'm by. It's hard to tell on the camera, but I'll see if I can pick it up. So it might get a little wobbly for a moment. I'll stand my back up to this one. <laughs> so it's, I'm on a hill on a slant, but it's taller than me. And I am 5'9". <laughs> trying to show you that I'm standing, but... Hmm. These amazing record keepers. So from where I live, the love in my heart and look at what they're um, overseeing, taking in so much of this beautiful land and the amazing forest. <laughs> and then the mountains on this rainy, foggy day. All my love and blessings.